what the fuck happened last night? We did a live stream, I remember that much, and I remember taking a couple of shots, and the next thing you know, I'm laying down on a couch covered in fucking Twizzlers, naked. It was crazy. Um, if you didn't see, we did a stream, and it was one of the most wild ones in my fucking career, so thank you guys for coming through. And also, I want to give a big, big shout out to the creator of the thumbnail in this video. He's actually a really talented artist. His name is Tommy Case. Tommy, I hope I'm saying it correctly, Tommy Case, Tommy Case, but he drew this amazing artwork of Silvati, the new Pokemon form, um, well, not form, rather, it's the evolution of Type Null, revealed yesterday. So many props go out to this man right now, so definitely check him out in the description of the video, give him some love, tell him your boy Etika sent you, I mean, he's got a DeviantArt on Twitter, so give him those props, and yes, before any of you guys ask, of course I asked him for permission, we don't do that over here, too, well, too much, <laughs> we don't do it, I asked him for permission, permission so we're all good, okay? We're, we're, we're all good. One of the other things we did in the stream yesterday was watching this crazy anime where the girls like fight with their boobs and their butts, man. That shit was insane, bro. <laughs> Air pressure, what? I didn't know my ass could do that. You can't just throw your ass haphazardly. You gotta make sure you take strategy into play. Two niggas! Two niggas, baby! You gotta dodge that ass! Yo! What, Cannon? Are you kidding me? Nigga! I mean, a lot of people will say an anime like that does not deserve the time of day, like when we read that Kotaku article, but I don't feel that's the case. It seems like it's an engaging plot with diverse characters who all have such interesting personalities. I like it, man. And it has fan service as well. It's like a Senran Kagura in anime form, nigga. Because the Senran Kagura anime is not all that good, let's just be real. But I mean, still, we have this, uh, what is it called? Keijo? This shit was insane, bro. So definitely check that anime out. I think I'll be watching through a couple more episodes maybe later on but guys let's get to the meat and potatoes of what this video is supposed to be about it's about the new information for pokemon that was revealed yesterday and it was a motherfucking doozy so if we take a look at Cerebi real quick i just wanted to run through this like generally with you dudes first and then we can talk about the details after the fact so the images from core Coral had leaked earlier than when the new information came out but I didn't really cover it in its own video because it wasn't enough. Alolan Grimer, to be honest with you, I didn't really give too much of a fuck. But now we have new evolution of um, Jangma O, which we saw would have one, but we didn't get any pictures. And we also have Silvati, pictures of this nigga. I read through this earlier, but I wanted to go through it again with you guys and let you know what my thoughts are. So the first images from Coral Coral leaked and revealed the latest news, but when Type Null finds a trainer that it trusts, it destroys its helmet and evolves into Silvati. I love that fucking name! Silvati! I love it! Dude, I'm so hyped for fucking Type Null slash Silvati, man. The concept is insane to me. I know this game has, like, alchemic uh, origin, but... Jesus Christ, they pushed it to the maximum with this dude, and he might just have a really deep, kind of complex plot to the Pokemon story, um, way more complex than it might seem on the surface, but, you know, alchemy, this nigga's comprised of a bunch of parts, there might just be a connection there. Apparently it's saying that it has the ability to change its type, there's a special hold item called memory that lets it be one of all 18 types at any one time thanks to its ability called AR system. I really, really, really hope that they keep the name of it. And this thing really seems like it's also going to be some kind of Arceus, um, maybe like a watered down Arceus. It looks like Arceus. I mean, look at the goddamn thing. This shit is crazy, bro. But it's not currently known if it's one item that can change this or if there are 18 different items. The type change is reflected in its eyes, its mane, and its tail, which glow the color representing the type. To me, man, it seems like the writing is on the wall with this guy. I'm just hoping that the stats are good, but come on, look at him. He does not seem like he'll have bad stats in the slightest, man. This Pokemon looks so fucking cool, guys. I'm excited about this one. It's a guarantee to be on my team, 100%, man. No jokes. This Pokemon, Silvati, this is, this is a game changer right here. And, and like another thing that I gotta tell you I love is just the concept of the helmet coming off. It's unleashing its true strength. Everything about Silvati's appearance from when it evolves from Type Null is exactly the same except the helmet comes off. Do you know how crazy that is? That's like Golem taking the bandage seal off of his chest and the power erupting, nigga. Isn't that so sick? 
the concepts of the Pokemon in 7th Gen are fucking insane, nigga! Insane! It also confirms the trial captain, Ilma, is the first trial captain, and the first town in Japan is known as Hawaii City. I kinda said this sorta sounds like Hawaii in a way, Hawaii? I'm not sure if that name will stay the same, but Titanol and Solvadi, oh my god, man. It sounds like it's a, it's a name of, what, like Southeast? or rather South Asian origin, Silvati. Kind of like a like an Indian sort of background to it, you know? Sounds like a god, like a deity. Silvati, oh my lord, I love that thing. Let me know if you guys share my sentiments in the comments as well. I'm being kind of a fucking lunatic right now. We also have Zhang Mo O, another interesting name for Pokemon. Type Null, Silvati, Zhang Mo O, good god, man, 7th gen. I cannot wait for this game. And plus, guys, we have the demo coming out in only five more days. We were waiting on the motherfucking leakers to try to crack the code of the game, but they have not been able to get their hands on it, so we're going to have to probably wait the full stretch, at least until the demo is somewhat close to the release, because usually some people can like download it like maybe two days early and then play it like that. We'll have to wait and see, man. But these Pokemon concepts are so fucking sick, guys. You got to let me know which one of these is your favorite release. And then um, Jung Ma Oh, not to totally overshadow this Pokemon as well, he evolves and he um, has actually three stages. What are the names of these guys? Um, Jangmo O, Jarango, and Jararanga. Oh my god, nigga. And the, plus, the typing is insane, too. I, this thing is a uh, fighting dragon? Fighting dragon is ridiculous, bro. I cannot wait to see this guy in action. He's almost a guaranteed staple on any hyper aggressive offense team. I think we're going to be seeing a lot of Jangmo O's evolution. Jararanga? Jararanga? Jararanga, nigga? Um, what the fuck? Wait, how do you say its name? Jara. Ja ra ra ja ra ra ja ra ranga ja ra ranga nigga I like it maybe they can keep that one the same name I it sort of has like this this wild this 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 visceralness to it ja ra ranga I like that shit um so guys what do you think of all this stuff obviously you know what I'm the most excited for but you might have different sentiments so I would appreciate it if you share those in the motherfucking comments um, we might just pull a motherfucking scares today do a double upload in this bitch because there's a lot of stuff that we need to talk about we've been doing a lot of Pokemon coverage lately though so we're gonna try to mix it up a little bit gonna do something a little bit more on the silly side for maybe the next upload or maybe two uploads down the line and once again niggies I'm not gonna show numbers no more. I'm just gonna say a thank you, new niggas. If you're in here with your boy, you subscribed recently. I appreciate you. Thank you for joining on board. We're gonna have us a motherfucking good time. But anyway, guys, I will talk to you all in the next video. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.